But we begin tonight with a Hollywood hired gun who's been working here in Metro Detroit. Last night, he brought the curtain down on two guys running their own pirate production house. We're talking about two bootleggers here trying to tape a big new release. 7 Action News reporter Jim Kurtzner shows us how this drama ended in Clinton Township. In some ways, this case is unique because it was a private investigator from New York City who had the trail on these two guys busted last night. The two gentlemen that they suspected of bootlegging these tapes had actually uh, been doing it at the movie theater. They needed to catch him in the act and did. Check it out. Here's the video camera they smuggled in. They simply clamped it onto the arm of their seat, covered it with this towel, and roll them. The target this time, the just released movie, Gravity. They've apparently ripped off other movies inside the Star Theaters because a hidden watermark shows up when they post their bootlegs online. That's how the PI was on their trail. The bigger the movie, the more the thieves can make, and the more money Hollywood can lose. And they millions take and millions of dollars. Absolutely. And uh, for somebody to do that, they have a very little investment in it. The industry has to stay on top of this. I'm told by one of their spokespeople, the cameras are better. They can put the bootleg copies on the internet. That's why they have to keep enforcement up to keep this to a minimum. In Clinton Township, Jim Kurtzner, 7 Action News. All right, Jim, and here's a look at the fines and possible jail time you could serve for taping movies in Michigan theaters. The first time, you can be fined up to $10,000 and spend at least a year in jail. For a second offense, up to $20,000 and two years in jail. And for people who get caught a third time taping movies, they could be fined $40,000 and spend four years behind bars.